Assalamu alaikum my brothers and sisters here is an inspiring story which you will love to listen he made her cry this is a story of a muslim couple who recently got married the nikah took place simplistically in an islamic way and they started their life with the blessings of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The wife was too excited and glad to be with her husband. It was just a month ago that she married him and her days were going finely beautiful. She wanted to be the reason for her husband's happiness and used to do things to please him. Every morning she used to prepare some breakfast for him and serve it with a lovely smile on her face so that his day could start with some positivity. Ironing her clothes, choosing a perfume for him, sometimes combing his hairs and doing a lot of other stuff become a part of her routine. Weeks passed by and by the grace of Allah their relationship was going well. But there came a day when the wife couldn't wake up early in the morning and slept for a longer time as she was going through some natural stomach pain and was feeling unwell. Suddenly her eyes got opened and it was around 8 o'clock in the morning. She got panicked and got up and saw that her husband was not around. So now you have got time to wake up? asked the husband with some anger in his tone while entering the room. It's done above the head and I haven't even taken my breakfast yet. The husband continued with his rough tone. Why don't you sleep for longer? When I die with hunger, you'll be happy, right? I didn't marry you so that you could sleep all night long and I may die with hunger, understood? The wife was surprised. A tender heart felt like broken into pieces. Her eyes got filled with tears. She felt like numb. Her throat got dry and she tried to speak but her voice couldn't even reach beyond her throat. She was completely shocked to see such a behavior of her husband whom she loved with all her heart. She said, I- I- I'm sorry, said the wife with cheer in her eyes. What sorry? replied the husband. Don't sit here like a queen. Prepare something to eat fast. The wife got up, entered the kitchen and quickly prepared something for him to eat. She served the breakfast and sat beside him. He looked at the breakfast, ate one or two pieces of food. What is it? You pulled the entire box of salt into it? Have you lost it? What's wrong with you? Leave it. I'll eat outside. That's what you want. Why? Said the husband angrily, banged the door and went out. The wife just couldn't hold her tears. It started coming down to her cheeks. She was just about to cry aloud. But suddenly, the alarm rang and her eyes got open. Alhamdulillah, it was a dream. It was around 7 o'clock in the morning. Her husband was not around. She got up and tried to see what her husband was doing. Suddenly, the husband entered the room. Hey, Habibti, you woke up. I hope you had a good sleep. I didn't wake you up as you were feeling unwell. And you know what? I tried to prepare some breakfast for us, but I'm sorry. I burned the fried pan and the taste is not good. Maybe I added some extra salt in the omelette. But don't worry, I also brought some chocolates and cakes for you. I hope that would be better for your health. The wife couldn't hold her tears. She went close to him, put her head over his shoulder. The tears started flowing. What happened, Habibi? asked the husband with some curiosity. You wanted something else? Ice cream? Brought a smile on her face. Alhamdulillah. Nothing, he said. Nothing. I just love you, replied the wife.